Hey, you, get over here. Good morning. My name is Eric Creel, and welcome to the Creel Studios. Oh, this is coming to a person who is a huge fan of Avatar The Way of Water, Disney's Wish, and Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. And don't forget Stranger Things, Hawkeye, Arcane, League of Legends, and the Ghost in Molly McGee as well. So, and I am here today to do my review on The Bad Guys, A Very Bad Holiday. So, The Bad Guys, A Very Bad Holiday, which is a holiday special, which is look like a pilot to the TV series, and it's basically like a prequel to the bad guys and basically happens when Mr. Wolf who want to found out to do some Christmas heist and then when basically soon as the bad guys need to figure it out to fix Christmas well they need to save Christmas and that's basically the plot for the entire movie I mean holiday special I meant so what do I heard about the bad guys a very bad holiday so the first time when this special was premiered on Netflix ever since November 30th that I watched it on November 30th and then I rewatched it f three times. Yeah, I watched I watched it three times and then what do I think of it? This special was great. Although uh, it's not as good as the movie itself, but I enjoy it. So the story of the special was pretty cliche. We heard the story thousands of times before and it ended up being like a pretty good story overall. The animation is pretty great. Yeah. Which is looked likely a Netflix series to me. And the characters we have Mr. Wolf. He's great in this one. Mr. Piranha. He's really awesome. Mr. Shark. He's cool. And you know me for a while that Mr. Shark is my favorite characters from the Bad Guys movie. And then we have Miss Tarantula. She's really awesome in this one. And then we have Mr. Snake. He looks pretty cool. And then we have Tiffany. She's an amazing news anchor. And all kinds of characters look pretty great. And the music scores look cool. So, if I have two flaws at a time, that one Diane Foxington was not in the special, which is pretty sad thing. And as well as the special did not aired on NBC, which is a Netflix quality, which is only on Netflix. Yep, which is a pretty sad thing. But don't worry. So overall, the bad guys a very bad holiday is pretty underrated holiday special, which is a looked like a pilot to a Netflix series. Let's hope for the Bad Guys Netflix series will be just as good as the movie itself. So I gave the Bad Guys a very bad holiday. Four stars out of five. It is definitely worth watching. And by the way, Gian Franks Productions, if you're watching this, if you are a fan of DreamWorks, go ahead and watch the Bad Guys a very bad holiday on Netflix. It's fun. For the whole family. Even though I do accept Hunter Firestone and Nick Hicks Spider-Verse and Frozen 2 fan to found some one's opinion about the special. But in my opinion, it's unrated. And that's my review on The Bad Guys A Very Bad Holiday. Tell me what do you think of my video. Let me know in the comments. And stay tuned for my random video which is a question mark that you all tell me what's all going to happen in every this month. Tell me what is yours. So, if you want to see more videos to my channel, click subscribe, click the bell button. If you want to see more messages, notifications. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. This is Eric Creel, and until next time, good bye!